group sex, homosexual sex, heterosexual sex, sex with friends, acquaintances, and even strangers. Welcome to the peaceful and sexy world of one of your closest primate cousins, the bonobo. Bonobos and common chimpanzees share around 99% of their genetic code with humans. However, there are some major differences when it comes to the ways in which these two primate species approach sex. For bonobos, sex is used as a way to form strong social bonds and even ease tension within the troop. Take this adult male bonobo. So far today, he's had sex seven times. He had a quick copulation with his female friend when he woke up this morning. He had sex with a few other males before they went in search of some food to eat. And upon their return, most members of the group engaged in sexual activities with each other in quick succession. When he saw another male having sex with his first partner, he didn't interrupt them. He had sex with another female bonobo instead. And then the females had sex with each other. And then several of the individuals in the group settled down for a long afternoon nap. Now, this adult male chimp hasn't had sex at all yet today. He's been busy defending his position as the biggest, toughest male in the group. He will violently attack any unfamiliar individuals, male or female, so that they know they've wandered into his territory where his favorite ladies live. He'll have sex with them when he wants to, giving the females little say in the matter. And he's probably not taking care of their needs either. Female bonobos, on the other hand, have been observed actually achieving what is believed to be orgasm, exhibiting telltale signs such as increased blood pressure and heart rate, and a series of involuntary muscle spasms. In fact, partner pleasure is an important aspect of sexual interaction in bonobo communities, whether that partner is male or female. Bonobos also engage in full mouth and tongue kissing, face-to-face -face sex and oral sex in both hetero and homosexual contexts. Males partake in pseudo-copulations with each other, where one briefly rubs his scrotum against the buttocks of another. This can become a group activity if many males engage at the same time. The bottom line is, unlike common chimpanzees, any kind of conflict or activity in bonobo society is directly addressed with sexual healing. They are the true biological equivalent of a society that makes love and not war. Maybe humans should channel their inner bonobos more often. If you want to see more copulation creations, check out this wild sex playlist. Let us know in the comments what animal sex stories you want to see. Thanks for watching and make sure to subscribe.